True freshman. <laughs> Emphasis on truth. <laughs> Hi, man. You got a shit today, bro. Man, chill out. Uh, it's early. It's early. Uh, mm. What you mean it's early, bro? Ain't never too early to get hyped, bro. <laughs> Ain't never too early to get hyped, man. Scrimmage day today. What you got to say, bro? What you got to say? Shit, what you got to say? It's time to get paid, bro. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Yo. Got to make gotta make some plays today. Got to, you know what I'm saying, showcase some talent today. Y'all stay tuned. It's going to be a banger. Start supposed to get a hell of a Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's good job, right? Yeah. Yeah. You know, with the one and only that boy. <laughs> that boy in the yeah. red group today, he getting paid today, man. Yeah, big yes, day sir. today, you know, for, for both of us. Fact, fact. You know, we about to get breakfast. Look, look, I kind of like a pregame meal real quick. Yeah. That boy got a cut, you know? Yeah, you know, you know. What's good with you? You did? I'm gonna get the sauce of the fish. Good song. I'm just like, mm, right? Then I'm gonna head to the train room, get some treatment on my shoulder. You know, it's bothering me right now, but, you know, get some treatment so I can feel as best as possible for the scrimmage. Yeah. You about to go to sleep or something, bro? About to sleep, bro. Am I? <laughs> Spring scrimmage. Let's see what Webster Etienne has in store for us today. Oh, Stay yeah. Tuned. Scrimmage over with those. Yeah, sir. That boy caught a kid. A bucky. A bucky. See, I know a lot of people was thinking, oh, it's a drop. My teammates talking about some pro. I thought he was going to drop that big drop. <laughs> you saw my boy with the big pick. Yeah. Yes, uh, sir. Yeah, true yeah. freshman. <laughs> Emphasis on true. <laughs> yes, sir. Appreciate it, coach. Hold on. 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 Hold Hey, turn that bell on. Yeah. God damn, he got some scribe. He's that light. I do it better. I do it better. Say it with me. Put the bell on. Put the bell on. After I talk, y'all say yo. After I talk, y'all say yo. Watch this. Watch this. Like? Yeah. Subscribe? Yeah. Watch this one. Hit that bell? Yeah. What? One more? Comment? Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Tell on them post notifications. Yeah. That's what I had him with this. He said, he said. Uh. Hey. Oh. Hey. <laughs> How would you rate your scrimmage today? 
because you did you did a lot of bad too. I, did I think a lot of bad. You did a lot of bad, but you had a lot had, of good. I had a lot of good also. So what? So what, I'm, what, what you rating it? I'm gonna give it. I'm just give it a seven, bro. I gotta give gotta give it in that seven? little range, like yeah, cause I mean I did give up a lot of shit, <laughs> but I also. But that, that pit, though, that pit that was, was nice, though. Hey, you feel me? Hey, yeah. yeah. That pit, hey, textbook, boy. Textbook, textbook, textbook. Hey, give me two. Me give too. me two. Yes, give sir. me two. Okay. You know you ain't I, I, I did score. I did no, score. Did <laughs> but next time, I promise you, you better get ready. Because your helmet going to be sideways. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I'll be pushing you. I'll be pushing you. Yep. So we going to the crib? Time to go to the crib. Finally. All right, so we just got done watching film. Um, I ain't really getting no treatment, but I got a little ice bag for my shoulder. Y'all know how I messed up my shoulder, right? So, you feel me? But, hitting, hitting big people up top and shit. Baby. Yeah, that's it. Big, Nine, big, big Cam Chancellor. <laughs> we and learned. You feel me? I learned from your experiences. That dude, like, I know now. That dude is like, was like 280. Yeah, like, yeah. Two, I think 260. I'm about, I'm about 190, so that's what, 70 pounds more? Yeah, you're like tripping. Ooh. But not for though. Like, if you know you're one of them people that, you feel me, hiding in the back, they're hitting you and shit. Like, <laughs> like I hope the coaches don't see you. That shit on camera. I'm going to got you at 4K. <laughs> like, <laughs> what you was doing? In front of the whole team. They were like, what you was doing, bro? It's funny because they don't care who up. Like, they don't yes. care. Like, yo, yes. I need to hit up top, boy. Yes. Like, so if you, they don't care if you, Feel me? 175 and a dude that's 260 just lined up. <laughs> it's your turn to go. He gotta go. And they're gonna, they gonna, they gonna be bad at you yeah. if you chop. Yeah. <laughs> Week one. Oklahoma. Week one. Oakley. Ooh. At Oklahoma. At Oklahoma. You know, it's gonna be a game. Y'all know how it is. Y'all know how it is. I ain't gotta say too much. You feel me? Got Memphis. This is gonna be a good game as always. Last year was a great game. And but well, this one's home this year. Ooh. It was home? It gotta be home. We've been playing on oh, yeah, That's true, that's true. It's gotta be that game about to be jumping. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, so I already know this is gonna be a good game. You know what I'm saying? We had a good game last year. Fold it, but it is what it is. ULM gonna be a good game. I got I know a lot of guys on ULM. Mm -hmm. Guys, Simeon, you know what I'm saying? Bugs. We got Bugs, got Bugs, got Popo. We got Popo. We got, got Drew. You know what I mean? My Everybody guys. My guys. Coastal gonna be a good game. We ain't played Coastal this year, but no, I know they played them the year before. before. Yeah. Feel me, Troy, you already know that's gonna be a great game. There was a uh, Sun Belt Champs this year. You feel me? UMass played them last year. That was one of the games that we won. Uh, yeah, gonna be a pretty good game. You know, I think this whole row gonna be good vibes. I played Marshall. Yeah, this whole row gonna be good vibes. Yeah. And Hopefully then we have can make it to a bowl. We need, we need hymns up there. That's the goal right now. We need them. But a good little schedule. I like the schedule. The Sun Belt schedule. Sun Belt schedule is raw. Hey, just look at that. Oh, shoot, you don't take the stairs no more. <laughs> only, only when, when, when I'm about to go to meetings or like practice. Like, yeah, I take you don't the take the stairs no more. But when it's an off day, like I'm sitting, come on, I got done with my workouts already, done with practices. Come on. Wow, what do I look like, man? Yeah. Back then, we used to take the stairs every time. Now, I love the caught a pick and stuff. Yeah. Well, they ain't gonna say that the way. I'm about to play this man real quick and slap him real quick so brother know that I still got it. We're going first to five. That's two. Oh, one one. Oh, yeah, there you go. Two. Two one now. Two. That's it. Two 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 three two. Three three. Yeah. Oh. Ah. No way. Oh, yeah. Well. Oh, 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 oh. That money. You gonna sit on that money or what? Nigga, what you gonna do? Easy. Oh, oh, no. You play. Guess what? Guess what? That ain't gonna look. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Yes. 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 Watch work now. Watch work. Gang. Oh my god! Oh so my ass. god! Come on. Let's go. You trying to hit the back boy and shit? You see? You trying to hit the back boy and shit? That would that get you? Him! That would that get you? That would that get you? I had so much chances that to win that. That would he get you? What? You feel me? You know what I'll always be able to say? What? That I got better hands than you. 
I don't care. Some of y'all like to stick around and just wait for that, that one school that texts you once every week. But just because it got a bigger logo, y'all entertain that shit. And some of y'all be acting all hard to the schools that text you every day. Like, that one school that texts you every single day. So now that I'm back home from getting treatment and watching film, I'm, I'm really done for the day. Like, I ain't got nothing else to do. But I came across the Cam Newton video. I don't know if y'all saw it. Think that Kirby Smart needs you? You think Nick Saban needs you? You stupid. You going to Tennessee? Have y'all going to schools that don't even offer you? If you're good, it don't matter where you go, they gonna find you. I promise you that. A lot of y'all, y'all wanna go to the Alabamas, the North Carolinas, the North Carolina States. Y'all gonna be there for four years and I have a meaningful game. Oh, uh, but I gotta catch though, it was senior day. It was a slant, relax. Bro, you better go somewhere where you gotta put yourself first because when you play for that G, when you play for that A, when you play for that T, when you play for that AU, bro, they're putting themselves first. They're bulletproof. Nothing and no one will ever, I got you, will ever mess up their situation, whether a quarterback, receiver, DB, nothing, coach. Man, that those schools are bulletproof. So to think that they want me, they need me, man, bro, they don't need you. He was pretty much just giving like his guys I think it was his team, I'm not sure, but you know, a bunch of guys, high school guys, uh, advice on picking a school. You know, he was talking about how a lot of guys want to go to the schools with the big logos, the big names. You know, they want to go play for Nick Saban and Kirby Smart. You know, when he was saying those schools are bulletproof, he was pretty much saying like, bro, when you when you go to those schools, you you, you like you really can't stand out because there's like a million of views. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're bulletproof in terms of if they needed to replace you today. It would be nothing but for them to make a call, send a text, and boom, you're replaced just like that. I agree with him, man. Like a lot of a lot of guys, they wait for that big name school. Like they have that school, that big name school that's texting them one time a week. But there's this uh, group of five school, you know, or this uh, this FCS school who's texting you every single day and showing you love. Like I'm talking about, they they, they want to get to know you. They want to get to know your hobbies. They want to get to know your family. But you know. Y'all, you know, we like y'all continue to wait just for that big school, you know. And I just want to say, in my terms, like I went through that. You know what I'm saying? I went through that. Uh, of course, all of us want to go power five. Like I had the mindset too. Like, I want to go power five, but you know, a wise man once told me, like, love who loves you. You know, like when those, when those power five schools were, they, they was really playing games. Let's be honest. You know, they weren't they weren't as consistent as you know Arkansas State was. These power five schools, you know, they were showing love for sure. But I could tell that. When they showed that love, I was more of a plan B, plan C, plan D type of guy. Like the guy that they would go after if they didn't get the guy that they really, really wanted. You know, and a lot of us do that. I ain't gonna lie, a lot of, a lot of us going through that process do that. But a lot of guys like three stars, you know, like myself, um, get to go power five, right? And they just get looked over, bro. They just sit there and ride the bench for about a year or two. And then they end up hitting the transfer portal and going to a school that they should have went to initially and then they ball out but it's like damn you like you wasted a year you wasted you know a year two years when you could have just did that initially so you know from my experience i, I would just tell y'all like go to you know where you're loved bro like love who loves you and when you get there just make the best of your opportunity bro like we you know that that, that transfer portal stuff is real like as y'all can see the numbers is, is real high it's a lot of guys who just made the initial mistake um and you know thought they could you know do that and then it just didn't turn out the way that they wanted it to turn out but yeah I just wanted to you know piggyback off of Cam Newton it was a real interesting video I, I felt like I related to it and that I agreed with it so if you made it this far into the movie comment down inspirational webs in the comment section you know what I'm saying I'll be trying to drop dimes for y'all because I don't want y'all just to watch the process I want y'all to actually learn from the process you know especially the guys that are younger than me or even just going through it with me like I want y'all to just learn from me don't make the same mistakes that a lot of us do and i just feel like nobody ever told people this people a lot of people don't talk about this so i just hope y'all boys you know learn from it and actually use it to y'all advantage and if you enjoyed this movie man make sure you leave a like and make sure you subscribe man hey without further ado stay hey, beyond i was gonna uh, say it from the background you're weird <laughs> Stay beyond. Stay real. Stay litty. And it's beyond reality signing off. Okay.